Welcome to Media Heads TV. Hey, didn't see you there. Been gone for three weeks on a vacation. Now I'm just ironing out the kinks. Get it? Ironing out the kinks. There's, there's kinks in the, the green screen. No? All right. Fuck it. Transition. Hello, people on the internet. This is DJ Crossfade. Today, we have a couple tweaks. And also, I'm going to go over a method to make your Serato, Mix Vibes, Virtual DJ, or whatever work. Uh, the first thing you're going to do is install Net Framework. I don't know why that wasn't clear the last video. People were telling me I wasn't clear enough. But that's the main thing you want to install is net framework and you're gonna see that on the screen right now make sure people to to follow what's going on and I apologize for the bad editing that happened last time <laughs> right about now you're seeing the net framework that I'm pointing to install that and let's go on to the next bit of this video you feel better motherfucker shit that's all you had to say one of the things you're going to notice after you install Windows 10 is this transparent bullshit. It's it's complete bullshit. And it, it does take some resources. Uh, I don't. I don't like it. I mean, if you have the power, I guess. You can kiss my ass. Oh, if I offend anyone by saying that uh, you're in the wrong YouTube channel. Just saying. I, I don't take things seriously. I, I don't. What? Why the fuck do you think there's a donut transition? So this is not going to be professional, by the way. Moving on. So how are you going to turn this transparent bullshit off is quite simple. Bam. So you right click on desktop, personalize, go to your colors, go to the bottom, switch that off. You are set to go as far as that goes. Next thing, you're going to look up uh, control panel. By the way, I would pin it taskbar here so you don't have to keep doing this uh, just by uh, pinning here. Just usually it just says pin taskbar. Do that. You're going to go to control panel, large icons, system. Oh, pause if you need to, by the way. Advanced settings. Take off all the animations and fades. I don't like it. That's just me. And it takes up uh, some extra resources. So turn that all off. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. There's some more tweaks that I'll be testing out. Like unparked CPU. That gave me a big frame rate increase within Windows 8. So it allows the game or whatever program you're using to have access to all cores. The problem with this on laptops though, of course, is, uh, well, <laughs> that battery is going to die real quick. And I, I will be uh, bringing out more videos hopefully this week. Maybe I'll talk about my vacation. In fact, I'll probably most likely do that. May the power of the cheesecake donut be with you. May the power of the cheesecake donut be.